Well, the reason why I like school board meetings is because they're the picture of our democracy. They're just everyone's calm and they listen to each other and everything's rational <laughs> these days. You know, right. if you want to know where the real right, you know, where the real sensible people are, go to a partisan, school board meeting. bipartisanness, yeah. working together, working together, mm-hmm. uh, going across the aisle. <laughs> this lady has a concern, and I'd like you to hear it. Hi, Lisa. Welcome. Merry Christmas. Is he, ever, so far, everybody's being super polite with each yeah. other, don't you think? Seems yeah, cordial. it seems cordial. Okay. Oh, hold on one second. I'm going to read. Hi, Lisa. Welcome. Hi. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to you. Um, I have a, a speech prepared to read regarding um, the test to stay program. And- uh oh. When Lisa's uh, got a speech prepared, you know, speech. it's about to go down. The test is. Speech. Test- speech. Yeah. speech. 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 <laughs> Lisa. Lisa. <laughs> Champion of all things good. <laughs> the test us day, what she's referring to there, which we'll get back to a little bit in the conversation. <laughs> the test us day is what it sounds like. It's the uh, kids getting tested for COVID before they return to the classroom for in-person okay, learning. Okay, seems reasonable. Seems, hey, my kid. What's wrong with the test? I don't know. We just stick some shit up. I do it all the time. <laughs> yeah. It's just the way we live, right? It's where the society yeah. that we live in today. Yes. How unconstitutional it is, but... I need to address something else, not just to you as the board, um, but to parents and grandparents and taxpayers in our community. Uh, Thank God we have someone like Lisa on our team. Yeah. Eyewitness News 7, Lisa, our consumer <laughs> reporter, will be talking about the test us day. It's unconstitutional. <laughs> She'd like your grandparents, your parents. I like how she said it's, uh, it's unconstitutional, but I'm not even going to talk about that. I don't want to talk about that. I'm yes. going uh, to reserve that. I'm going to re- yeah. <laughs> let that go By the way, now. there is a clock going. She has three minutes to talk. So okay. the good news is we won't have to endure her for long. <laughs> Still wrapping my brain around this a little bit, but... Um, Yesterday, I heard something, um, and I was stunned. And today, I am equally stunned and a little bit upset. Well, not a little bit, a lot of bit upset. She heard insane clown posse for the first time. <laughs> right, or time. Slipknot. Yeah, Slipknot or something. <laughs> she's a lot of bit upset. A lot of it. You know, it grew on her. She was upset yesterday, but today she's really she's upset. A lot oh, of it. Lisa, I'm waiting on bated breath to hear what you have to say. It's going to be super intelligent, I can tell. <laughs> Curious. I, don't, I would even use that word, but um, I want to talk to about. She's the shaking, fact it sounds like. Yeah, she's she is. Shaking. She's shaking. She's mad about she's this. She's mad and nervous in wait, front of the and, people. Wait until you hear what Lisa is upset <laughs> okay. about. Wait, wait till you hear Does what Lisa. Does it have something to do with testing? It has nothing to do with testing. Oh, okay. Just going to give you that. Yeah, and I know this is going on nationwide, so it is not just for your, for this board, but our community. This is an epidemic. She wants you to know this is going on nationwide. She Everywhere. knows it. She's done an investigation. Mm-hmm. He needs to understand that the agenda that is being pushed through our schools is um, just my opinion. But Just her opinion, but she needs everybody to know. Yes. <laughs> She's done an investigation, <laughs> but it's just her opinion. Uh-huh. Somewhat nefarious when it comes to some of the um, activities. So let's talk about fury, furries. <laughs> <laughs> nefarious furries? <laughs> Whoa. Nefarious furries. This just became the best thing I've ever heard. This is why I had to play this. <laughs> nefarious furries. Okay. It's an epidemic nationwide. <laughs> She's mad. She's more mad today than she was yesterday. <laughs> just wanted to let you know. A lot that. of bit. A lot of bit. It was addressed by a child. Uh, a couple months ago, that they are put in an environment where there are kids that are that identify as a furry, a cat or a dog, whatever. And that's not what a furry is, by the way. They don't identify <laughs> as a cat or a dog. They dress up like they a cat up, or a dog, yeah. or typically comic book characters. At least yes. you got to get your investigation straight here before you take it to the mainstream <laughs> media. So yesterday, I heard that at least one of our schools in our town has a in one of the unisex bathrooms a litter box. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a cat. A litter box with a unisex. I hear that lawyer. I'm not a cat. I'm not a cat. I'm not a cat. <laughs> this is an agenda pushed by Pretty Kitty Litter by Arm and Hammer. Fresh step. Yeah, fresh step. Fresh step. Fresh step is in our school. Fresh step. Hey, kid, come here. <laughs> you want to pee like a cat? <laughs> I got fresh litter in the unisex bathroom. I don't care what you identify Try it. as. Try Give it. you a tasty. You just squat out just a little tasty <laughs> Tina. Just a little first, Tina. First box is free. <laughs> <laughs> Once you go cat, you never go back. <laughs> hey, have, you, have you ever peed sitting down on kitty litter? Mm, there's nothing like sand directly on your man scrotum. 
God. You might have to get a wipey and wipe that <laughs> that lid off your balls, boy. But I'm telling you what, you'll never go back. This is what all the kids are doing. <laughs> A kitty litter, a cat litter box in the bathroom. Lisa, you have been played by a TikTok yes. video. No, there are not litter boxes in the unisex bathroom nationwide. Don't you think this would be on the front cover yes. of every newspaper ever? You're such a moron, Lisa. For the kids that identify as cats. And um, <laughs> Wait, I, hold on. I was just picturing, you know, how everybody has the pronouns now. She, her. She, her, it, know, them, they. Yeah, yeah. they. It would be cat. Cat. Feline. <laughs> Pussy. Feline cat. <laughs> feline. Yeah. I identify as feline. <laughs> really uh. disturbed by that. And I I will do some more investigation on that. I know what's going on nationwide. I know it is. It's part of the agenda that's being pushed. I don't by agenda. 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 By who? <laughs> Who's pushing an agenda to have your children pee in a litter box? <laughs> And by the way, they pee in a urinal. I mean, is a litter box any different, really? <laughs> Have you yeah. ever been to a public school bathroom? It's fucking... Those kids don't know how to control they, their bowels. Well, I mean, they probably put the cat box in there just to keep the spray off the floor That's or right. pee off the floor. Yeah. Have you ever had a child? <laughs> yeah. And, ben, and now Matias likes to use my bathroom now. I'm telling you, I have to do a whole disinfecting routine before I go in there. Yes. Not that I think my kid's pee is weird or anything, but I can't take the poop. The poop, forget about it. I'm, no. a, I'm out on the poop one. But the pee, I can deal with it, right? But I swear to God, he just plays with yeah. his, his spray. He well, just plays exactly. with the spray. Just what everywhere. else are you going to do when you're yeah, that Lisa, age? you got better things to do with your time. I know you do. You, you're a mother of children. <laughs> This is the worst thing you're concerned about is a litter box. Let the kids have a litter box. Who fucking cares? They're playing make believe. They play in a sandbox. It's just the same. You don't think the raccoons are in there peeing all day long? Or Come kids. On. Or kids. Yeah. <laughs> you ever been to a public pool, Lisa? You ever been to white water, Lisa? It should be called yellow water, <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> white water. <laughs> fucking yeah, disgusting. For sure. Lisa, stop it. Stop it. You're catastrophizing something that doesn't need to be catastrophized. There are kids. There is a thing. It's not called Furbies or furries or whatever you refer to, where children are identifying as an animal. You know why they're identifying as an animal? Because it's a safe place for them to go in their heads. And it's fun. It's make-believe. And it's okay. For the most part, it's okay unless it's absolutely destroying their lives. Let them have their make believe yeah. the world is such a serious fucking place because of dumb shits like you. True. Because of dumb shits like you standing up in front of a school board meeting, wasting precious fucking time when you could be talking about how you make education better, how we pay teachers more, how we get children more educated. And you're standing up there talking about a litter box that never existed in the first place. And even if it did, who fucking cares? Let yeah. the kids play make believe. Lisa's failing. Lisa, you fail. I don't, I don't even want to understand it, but I think that people need to be aware of it because I am really upset. That's the problem, Lisa. You don't want to understand it. Know. You don't want to understand what's going on with your children. So you would rather just throw some obnoxious and obsequious bullshit out there and try and get people all riled up and upset. You would rather fight the good social fight. Uh, the right, you would rather be a right fighter in, in front of live TV than you would to sit down and talk to your children and ask them exactly why they're putting on a Furby costume and pissing in a kitty litter. And <laughs> by the way, if you're going to use kitty litter, use Fresh Kitty. Use yeah. Hello Step. Hello uh, Step. Fresh Step. This commercial break is brought to you in part by Hello Step. <laughs> Hello Step. <laughs> Hello Step. <laughs> Hello Step. That's right. <laughs> Are your kid are your kids peeing everywhere? <laughs> kids ages K through nine. <laughs> you should you could just get it. They could the litter box companies could actually make some money on this instead of the. Um, uh, that's what I'm saying. Around the toilet of custom made litter box. Okay, that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Put your squatty potty on the top squatty of the yeah. potty litter, litter box. box. Damn. Damn. I'm calling Dawn we when we're over with this. <laughs> yes. Dawn over a squatty we, it, potty. It happened here, folks. Yeah, it happened right here <laughs> because of Lisa. Just, Thank you, Lisa. <laughs> Thank you for ignoring the your next children. million dollar invention. I know. Do you see how this, you see what I'm saying? How yeah. this lady should probably be spending more time at home asking her kids exactly yes. what's going on in their lives yeah. rather than worry. You, how dumb do you have to believe uh, be to believe that this is actually happening and you haven't heard about it yeah. everywhere? <laughs> <I know. laughs> like, like, wouldn't that be the first thing your kids, every kid would come home yes, and say, yes. they put a litter box in the bathroom. <laughs> I, I think we have a cat <laughs> or Julie likes to pee standing up. I'm not sure. Yeah. <laughs> so stupid. Let's listen to what else she has to say. Just last for a okay. minute. That as a parent, that my child is put in an environment like that. And, um, 
You know, I'm all for creativity and imagination, but when someone lives in a fantasy world and expects other people to go along with it, I have a problem with that. Huh. Isn't that interesting, mm, Hoadley? Yeah. When other people live in a fantasy world and refuse to let other and refuse to hear what's really going on. Yeah, sounds like Lisa. Sounds like Lisa. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Lisa's talking about herself. So I'm just putting that out there. I will investigate more. Um, but as far as the test to stay program, why do I feel like Lisa is <laughs> now that, going back now to the going test. back to the test to stay program, which I won't get into. Who fucking cares? You know, I don't want to get yeah. into uh, politics. This is not political. Yeah. This is what this is the pro. This is the problem with parents and these fucking PTA meetings and these school board meetings right now is is that the parents are too busy worried about being right in mm-hmm. front of all the other parents mm-hmm. that they act like children while the children and then a face group but group gets started and things yeah. catch fire and it's ridiculous while the children have to yeah. act like adults yep. they have to be worried about all the adult things because the adults are too busy and whacking can't... each other off over fucking masks and testing and vaccines and litter you know, boxes whatever it is you know <laughs> uh what we're gonna are we gonna teach them whether or not the indians were slaughtered i mean come on just like get yeah. fucking real lisa, lisa.